The DA believes its federal convention, scheduled for this weekend, will be a landmark meeting that could see whoever emerges as its leader become the nation's president. That was according to Congress President Gregory Krumbach. Krumbach said DA prioritized the legitimacy and integrity of elections. DA believes person who emerged as its leader after federal convention over weekend could become country's president. The party says its belief is based on recent survey figures from independent organizations and its own internal polls. The chairman of two-day meeting in Midrand, DA MP Gregory Krumbach, addressed media about party's readiness ahead of federal convention, saying it was a turning point not only for party but for country's future. We believe this Congress is very important, recent opinion polls consistently reflect that the ruling party currently has around 40% of electoral support. Polls recently mirrored by Rapport and the Social Research Foundation's poll show that the DA has outstripped Congress. ANC in urban areas. We may be elected president of the country at this Congress this weekend, he said. DA National Spokesperson Siviu Gwarup echoed Krumbach's sentiments, saying elected leaders must understand that they must lead efforts to ensure growth in the party's support base. Gwarup said party wants to be part of the coalition that will rule country. Given our own research and results of the latest municipal elections, most likely outcomes in 2024 will be a coalition government. Then elected DA leaders will need to make sure that party is a key pillar in coalition that will lead country, said Gwarab. The DA is holding a press briefing this morning on the readiness of its national elective convention, which begins tomorrow at the Gallagher Convention Center in Johannesburg. News 24 Team News 24 Pick. Twitter H7 AL H3 I6 Junior Kumalo March 31, 2023 Krumbach said that given importance results of this Congress, party prioritized legitimacy and integrity elections. He said the DA does this by ensuring that the voting process is free and fair while all candidates are reviewed. According to Krumbach, the DA also ensured that approximately 2,000 delegates were selected to represent South Africans. Krumbach added approximately 2,000 delegates from all over Turkey will attend. According to party policy, at least 45% delegates must be non-public representatives to ensure that voices of all DA members and supporters are reflected in the results leadership race. He said that before the Federal Congress, about 400 media members showed interest in the accreditation process. That was in anticipation that something big will happen during the 2024 national elections, he said. According to Krumbach, DA delegates from all over the country have begun arriving in Johannesburg, and registration will begin Saturday morning. He added that the party has set up an electronic voting system ensure that no human error occurs due to the large number of votes expected be cast. Krumbach dismissed concerns by former Johannesburg mayor for fallots that using the online voting system on social media could harm his own camp. What candidates or a candidate say about the voting system is their own opinion and we cannot comment on that, but presiding officers can address delegates and allay their fears about the voting system. The post appears to be on the wall for fallots, as DA leader John Steen Wisen has support from nearly all state leaders, including Gauteng, where fallots' support base is expected to arrive.